Let's talk about call recording on a Samsung device. Here I do have the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. I'm using the latest available build. It is One UI 6.1 and yes guys, this is 6.1.1 functionality, but you'll never see a 6.1.1 or an X.1.1 .1 in a device that is not a flip or a fault because X.1.1 .1 versions usually until now are only reserved for those devices, but this is this functionality, like all the AI stuff and etc. And as you can see, I'm using October security patches and the update is AXI8. My phone is from Europe and you can see uh, that I do have uh, the EUX CSC, that's the new CSC, the combined one. But how is this relevant? Let me show you. And now I have picked up the phone, but still no call recording here. So in this video, I want to check if the latest One UI 6.1.1 still works with changing the CSC to something like THL or SEK or others that do support the call recording. So if you're interested into native call recording for your Samsung phone, could be the S23 Ultra, the S24, buckle up. And let's start. Let me show you how we can use the SAM FW tool 4.9 to change the CSC. We're gonna basically need three things. First thing, of course, is the phone. You need to go inside the developer's options and enable USB debugging. And then second, we also need a PC, hook up the phone, and of course, start SAM firmware tool 4.9. Now, let's see if that magic is still gonna work. Once you have started the SAM firmware tool, directly go to ADB and press on the info. Click here and then ADB info. The idea here is to check if your phone is connected to your PC via ADB and you will require platform tool. So if you don't have this, follow the link. It's gonna be in the first command, download this and go inside the developer's option and enable USB debugging. If you have connection, the next thing you should do, guys, is go here inside MTP and then just press change CSC, right? Now, of course, the tool is going to check your phone and it's going to give you here a list with all the supported CSC codes from your device. So it's actually safe to just go there and choose whatever you want. Or you can go and type a value here manually, but most probably this is not gonna work. Now, in the sake of this video, I'm going to use THL, which stands for Thailand. But before you press the change button, we need to do something else. Go inside your dialer and then press star hash zero star hash. This thing is gonna put your phone in the test mode and then you can hit change. And right now guys, cross your fingers because the sound firmware tool is gonna try to do the magic again. And if it's successful, which I do believe and I hope that this is gonna work, then my EUX CSC will be replaced or changed to the THL. Why are we doing that? Because the THL supports call recording and some other nice fancy stuff. So now guys, phone is rebooting. Let's see what happens. Under about phone software information, you're gonna see that right now I am indeed using still the latest One UI 6.1.1 with the October patches, but then also I'm using THL. And now it's just about time to call Athena again. And by the way, something popped up here that I didn't have before. Turn on color ID and spam protection to identify colors and protect yourself. So you can just click here. You can now use this stock functionality. Go inside the settings, guys, and you're gonna see here something called record calls. So this is absolute stock. You can also auto record your calls. This means when you're calling someone, the moment he's picking up, boom, call directly automatically recorded. Show notification after recording, which is very handy. And then also you can go <laughs> and check for the recorded calls. And of course you have the option to delete all recordings. I'm calling Antina and you can see that the red button is on. So let me pick up the call. All right, let me put it on a speaker. Okay, oh my God, you don't want to hear this. So let me just try to kill the microphone. Okay, I'm going to kill it here. Click the record button. And you can clearly see that recording works. Now let's check it out. Full recorded, saves in internal storage. So we can directly open it in voice recorder. And now voila. As simple as that with beautiful audio quality. Any recording notification? And the best thing about it, the person that you're calling isn't notified. If you're in Europe, beware, might not be so nice to do so. 
Let's check the quality, guys. So it's mono, not stereo, and the bit rate is 128 kilobits per second, 48 kilohertz sampling rate. So it's not so bad, right? And if you don't want to use it, just hook your phone back to your PC via ADB, use some firmware, and just put your original CSC. Why? When you change your CSC, but you're still using it in the region you bought it from, you might be not getting over the air updates or they can be delayed for you. It doesn't happen all the time, but it could happen. What I'm doing when I need this, I enable it, right? When I know there is an update, I just go back to EUX, get my OTA updates and that's it. And if you have liked this video, go watch some of my other videos. Thank you so much for watching. VST over and bye.